headed out for a late morning walk in the woods with Bella. Changeable weather, I decided to wear the black leather coat. My hair needs cutting, but I had combed it back, and in my black leather, I felt like Elvis. Thirty minutes into the walk, and the sun was blazing down, hot, sweaty, and tiring in the leather coat. I took it off, and I slung it over one shoulder. Felt like Jack Kerouac. Jack Kerouac. To a stream. Bella waded in and lay down, cooled off. I watched, feeling imprisoned in my species, in my inhibitions, in my leather coat. I put the coat on the grass and I sat on it. Watch Bella bathe and drink like some wildebeest at the Serengeti. Felt like David Attenborough for a wee while, admiring the nature around me, the bluebells, the wild garlic, the wildebeest, and then like an ancient yogi sitting in meditation his lion skin to keep off the snakes. Feeling burdened by my coat in the continuing sunshine, I felt betrayed by the fickle weather, by my own pessimism, but mostly by a God that doth send such mixed weathers that his vessels knoweth not what to wear. I felt cursed by the damn leather coat, as if the lords of karma were repaying me for being unkind to vegetarians all my life. Returning home, hot, tired and sticky, I felt like a cup of tea and a nap. I also felt like sharing my thoughts. Perhaps I was feeling lonely as the folk had given wide berth to the mad dog and the Englishman out in their near midday sun in their fur and leather coats, respectively. Their fur and their leather coats respectively. Yeah.